Okay, folks, hey, we're back for an Italian flavored table for summer. We're having Mama Lucia's lasagna and a Spirito Italiano. A little sidecar of Galliano, right here on my take on Home and Garden. In the spirit, speaking of espirito, the spirit of being different, showing something different. Right, Grace? <laughs> so we're toning down our table as far as its formability, formal. A little less formal, but we're staying completely elegant. That's what I'm trying to convey here today with an Italian style table. Now I've got this wonderful crystal bud vase and I want to do a quickie different arrangement. So we got this beautiful white antique rose with a pink tangerine cheek. Okay, and we're going to get them in there. Give them a little bend. This is pretty good size. I want odd, you know how I think. So five of those. Then I have our wonderful tangerine colored. Look how cute the leaves. In a ranunculus. So I've got my base in. We'll bend that a touch. I'm looking for bare spots, which I have one over here, and I'm going to use the biggest flower in there. Now, only one left. i thinking I want this to come up a little bit. Ooh, lovely. Look at that tangerine bud vase. Get that in there a little bit. Okay. This particular bud vase, it's all contained. You saw our wonderful denim-like 100% cotton tablecloth, 70 inch, you saw in our hall. Then, where you're gonna fit in with the summer decor other than right here with this Beautiful, oversized, spaghetti night, Italian night dinner plate. Good enough to share the salad, and typically that's why they're big. So you only have one plate. Now I'm going to take the napkin, open it, and go back half like this and place our plate. Okay guys, so let's look at what we're gonna use today. Besides our beautiful plate, bought at Home Goods last year by Maxerna. Then we have a wonderful deep baking dish from there also and an oven mitt yellow with a rubber bottom from Hobby Lobby. We have a cobalt blue fruit bowl, assorted cheese, and what looks like Fiesta ware. These were a thrift, and they're by Citrus Grove. These cute, I'm using for marinara sauce, Maxerna again from Home Goods. And the blue Chevron creamer and farmhouse milk pitcher from Hazel Atlas American in the 30s. And here we have Hazel Atlas again 
in this depression plate. Then in vintage, we're going to use our wonderful Anchor Hocking 1960s to the 90s in the Wexford pattern. And we have a drinking glass and we have a cordial glass in that same stemware. You can see that size comparison. Then our wonderful stainless silver flatware by Wallace. We get the detail on that pattern. Just gorgeous. Okay, now you know what we're using, we can get going. Here's our table so far. No charger this time. Can you believe it? And we're going to do our silver flatware dinner knife, dinner spoon, and dessert spoon. And just for our new people, on the left, dinner fork on the inside, salad fork on the outside. I try to maintain a two finger distance from the edge. So we got one hot item we're going to place on our table. And that is our deep dish lasagna. And we'll keep it out of the way. And it's really just a side dish. The main dish is a rigatoni. Love the rigatoni. Okay, so we're having lemonade and lemon iced tea. Everybody will want some. Let's see where that'll go the best. Probably right about there. So we can cut our fresh lemons right on site. And we have our marinara sauce boat. A couple of cheeses. We'll have a bread on that hazel atlas. More cream sauce and butter sauce. And then we have two glasses, like I mentioned, for each setting. Okay, we have a water glass. I'm going to put that right about high noon. And a cordial for our Galliano. And of course, I'm going to do these and catch that up. How cute with the matching anchor hocking. So I'm running around getting the extra pieces and silverware. We got fresh shaved Parmesan for here, marinara there, all the drink glasses. We got a Galliano. Look at this just to show off and show what we're going to have. And I want to use the tea lights in the crystal votive again for this table. That I'm going to have to take you now and show you all around.
Guys, if you liked our taste of Italy today, abundanza. Give us a like, a share, a comment. Send a buddy over. Set your table. Set your beautiful table. Get those two or three things you're missing. Impress the family. Thanks, guys, for coming. Be good. Be happy. Have fun. This is a happy, happy, elegant table for summer. We'll see you for the next one. I don't know if we can beat it or maybe we can't beat it. <laughs> All right, guys. Buon amico. Ciao.